Uh, Hello. Can you tell me more about your group? How did you get to that uh, The choir's been going for about 10 years, uh, but we amalgamated a junior and a senior choir about four years ago and invited the six form in, so now we are standing at about 85 members. Well, one of my friends told me she was in the choir, so I came along and it was really fun, so then I've just stayed and I've been in it for four years now. It's awesome, we love it. It's so friendly and like, it's such a big energy from it, it's amazing. So. Yeah, I've learned a lot more about performing, I've had more opportunities to perform as well. Like, I never would have been able to sing at the Royal Albert Hall until like, the choir got chosen to sing there. I don't think I ever would have, ever. It's a really good experience. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, it's... Uh, it, it's, it's a bit of a dream really because we never thought that we would uh, we'd get this far. We got to Birmingham twice in the last two years and we didn't get uh, any award at Birmingham and we thought that was it for 2010 and then we got a phone call and it was just amazing really, unreal, so it's great to be here. Yeah, it's brilliant and especially because it's like all years of the school as well, it's not just like the old ones, it's like mixed, yeah. It's like the old ones help the younger ones and it's, it's cool. Yeah, I think we go for epic pieces. We're trying to work out what to do next because it's a bit of a big one and we're not quite sure what to do next. Um, we do do some sacred material as well. We've started doing some Mozart and some John Rutter, that kind of thing as well, just so we can mix it up. Uh, we've done some Beatles, gospel stuff, lame stuff, that kind of thing. Typical choir, uh, you know, pop choir repertoire as well as the classical. Thanks, Joe. Uh, he loves crashing cameras, he really does. Oh, he's gone now. <laughs> I think confidence is a big thing and it's really good for their social skills. Um, yeah, uh, still learning how to rehearse effectively because they're very noisy, uh, but it's great, you know, the sound that they give and uh, they've kind of embraced this comment that we get from the adjudicators saying that they're a wall of sound, so they take confidence from that. And here's Lewis, this is the next Elton John. And he's just been to see Elton John's piano and he's a bit in awe at the moment, aren't you, Lewis? I am. Can I just Mama, just feel the man. Put a gun against his head, pulled my trigger, now he's dead. <laughs> it brings those of stars together, like, obviously we were quiet, but then when we went to our, like, festival, we heard all, like, string quartets and, like, big bands, obviously, like, but I've never really listened to that kind of music before until this. It's nice that when we we do our music and then we can go and see what other people are doing and it can give us, like, ideas, like, we just do some more a cappella and stuff, and it, you know, gives you inspiration. Yeah. Yeah. I got me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>